ITX builds are compact, light, and generally more stylish looking compared to their MATX or ATX cousins. This bulky monster is not an ITX build. But building in ITX can be a challenge. You need to cram all of the hardware into a much smaller space and that smaller space makes it difficult to cool things efficiently. This is an ITX motherboard but you don't usually slap on such a large cooler on an ITX motherboard. Generally, you'll want a low-profile cooler and we're taking a look at one today, the Deepcool AN600. It is low-profile, it will fit, but can it get the job done? Now, Deepcool has an excellent reputation with us for coolers, so we didn't go easy on the AN600. We pitted it first against the stock cooler because for a lot of ITX builds, the stock cooler is a good default option just because usually they're okay in terms of performance and number two, that they will actually fit because stock coolers are usually a lot shorter, smaller than third-party coolers. And making life hard for the AN600, we also pitted it against the Noctua NHL9A. Noctua, of course, is Noctua, excellent reputation, at a more premium price point. Can the AN600 deliver against its more expensive rival? Our testing setup was a Ryzen 7 5800X, which can get pretty hot, but not a furnace like some of the other higher-end CPUs. It can get toasty, though. We had it in a new Volo Stec ITX case with the ambient temperature at 20 degrees centigrade and we ran Cinebench R23 and 24 for 30 minutes and recorded the max temp hit by the tested coolers. For the results, no surprise, the stock cooler was the worst performing with max temps hit of 81.1 degrees and 80.6 degrees in R23 and R24 respectively. Noctua comes in second place with a much cooler 65.9 and 66.3 in R23 and R24. And the coolest is the Deepcool AN600 with 62 degrees and 62.5 degrees in their respective tests. So there is a significant difference between the Noctua NHL9A versus the Deepcool AN600. The Deepcool edges it out in terms of cooling. But we should note that the Noctua low-profile cooler here uses a 90mm fan compared to a standard 120mm fan for the AN600. Interesting to see how an increase in fan size has a clear impact on cooling performance. No-brainer though, if you're in the market for a low-profile cooler and your case can fit a 120mm fan for the CPU cooler, then the Deepcool AN600 is an excellent choice. Thanks for watching. Paminsan, may nagtatanong kung may kilala ba kaming computer shop na trusted yung hindi ka lolokohin. Actually, meron. Kami. Full service PC store ang Hardware Sugar. Nagbabenta kami ng PC components. Nagbabenta rin kami ng fully assembled rigs. We clean computers. Kasama na rin yung excellent cable management namin and CPU cooler repasting sa cleaning. We also clean and repaste GPUs. Nasa Makati yung physical store namin and you can also buy from our site www.hwsugar.ph na 100% palaging up-to-date yung inventory dun. Kung in-stock yung item sa amin, available yun sa site. We also ship nationwide. Thanks for watching and maybe one of these days magkita tayo sa shop.